Hi, and welcome to the video that will show you how to create a custom report in Zoho CRM. Please watch the Introduction to CRM Reports video first in order to gain a general understanding of the Reports module. Now, let's discuss building a report from scratch. Navigate to the Reports module in Zoho CRM. Then click on Create Report. The first step is to select the modules from which you want to pull data from. You can select the main module to form the basis of the report and any secondary data from related lists or related modules. For this example, let's select potentials and accounts to see what deals are in our pipeline. The next step is to choose the type of report, tabular, summary, or matrix. Think of the tabular report as a simple spreadsheet. The summary report will segment your data and the matrix report will group your data in a grid. For this example, let's choose Summary Report so that we can segment the accounts by potential stages. Now, select the columns for the report. The columns will be the fields from the modules you have chosen. The order of the columns is important for the layout of the report. For this report, let's choose Account Name, Potential Name, Closing Date, Stage, and Amount. Next, select Grouping. Grouping is only possible in the summary and the matrix report. Since we want to see how many accounts are in each stage, we are going to group by potential stage. Next, look at columns to total. This section pulls all of the numerical fields in the modules you are running the report on. You can run a sum or an average, or have the report pull the lowest value or largest value. Let's see what the dollar value is in each potential stage. So for the columns to total, we are going to pick SUM for the amount field. Lastly, select the criteria. The standard criteria only applies to the date fields. Select a date field and a date range. For this example, I am choosing the potential closing date field and July as the date range. Below is advanced criteria. We can further segment our data by any other field under potentials or accounts. For example, we only want to see deals that are greater than $1,000. So I will choose amount is greater than 1,000. And I also only want to see deals in the United States. So I will choose country is USA. Now go ahead and save your report. The next step is to name the report, choose the report folder, and then run the report itself. On the next screen, you will see the report. Let's visualize our data in the report with a chart. Click on Create Chart and select the chart type. For this example, I am going to choose vertical bar graph. Now, your report includes both a bar graph and a spreadsheet. If you scroll down, you will see that the data on the spreadsheet is segmented by potential stage and the amount field has been summed up. We can also export the report into CSV, XLS, or PDF format. I hope you now have a better understanding of how to create a custom report in Zoho CRM.